A bizarre story in Maine this evening. A woman says that she requested her credit report from Equifax, and instead what she got was hundreds of credit reports belonging to people from around the country. Amazing. John Christos has more on this really unusual data breach. You have to see it to believe it. This is the deluge of mail Katie Manning says was waiting for her Monday night when she got home from work. Here's one pile and another and one more. More than 300 pieces of mail, all from the credit reporting company Equifax. It's one of three credit bureaus responsible for keeping track of all your personal and private information. I checked my credit report the other day online with Equifax. That was it. And next thing I know, I have 300 pieces of mail sitting in my mailbox. Every single one of these is addressed to her, but they're not hers. Instead, she got other people's credit reports. Now, names, social security numbers, dates of birth, current and previous addresses, bank and loan account numbers, all stacked up on a kitchen table in Biddeford. I'm not supposed to have this information. This is unbelievable. Somebody has messed up. So we called Equifax with some tough questions, hoping for some answers. Equifax Vice President of Corporate Communications told me on the phone, quote, this is a high priority. Obviously, this is a serious situation. I'm going to get our security and forensics teams involved. Equifax says it doesn't yet know if this is a widespread problem or how it happened. On the financial side, there's damage that would involve establishing, setting up a new account, getting a loan in someone's name. Um, all of those require a social security number. Jane Carpenter is an identity theft expert who worked in the attorney general's office and found in Maine Identity Services. She says someone could also steal tax refunds and medical information with what's in these stacks. Well, the Maine Bureau of Consumer Credit Protection now has all of the credit reports and has launched an investigation. We will keep you posted.